not a big job. So this is how you use it. For example, if you're breastfeeding the baby, you just wear it around your waist. Yeah, and just hold your baby and breastfeed the baby like this. We have the brush, we have the comb, we have the thermometer for temperature. I hope it works. We have the nail cutter down here. We have washable breast pads. So these are the pads that you use to on your bra when you're breastfeeding the baby. Yeah, so that you don't mess up and all. I'm also planning to get the electric pump so that I can always collect milk on one side as the baby is breastfeeding on the other side. and I'm excited to be back to your screen so today as you can see on the title of this video we are doing another baby shopping haul from Eastleigh this time around and last time I shared with you the Gikomba uh, haul for the baby and uh, I was happy to see you know so many faces coming to this channel to watch that video and you guys leaving massive comments down there if i helped you in one way or another guys just know that i'm so much excited to help you because i know how it feels especially being a first time mom and you don't have an idea of where you can get whatever you need for your baby right yeah so i also did more research and uh, found out about where you can buy some nice clothes or some nice things from Isley. you know for me i was like i just want to mix some thrifted clothes and some new ones and uh, some things from kamukunji i will be doing the kamukunji haul too so uh <laughs> stay tuned subscribe and watch just wait for the next video because i think in the next video i will be sharing with you the kamukunji baby shopping haul so yeah guys so i went to Eastley and i'm excited because i was able to get whatever i wanted according to my budget and yes guys so if you're new here receive my hug welcome 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 i love you so much welcome to this family in this family we talk about faith marriage and lifestyle videos okay so I think I have done a long introduction, <laughs> a long introduction, um, and it's time to get to the hall. Uh, one thing that I observed with this list is that there are so many malls uh, right there, and if you are, don't have an idea of where you are going, you may not be able to find what you want, or you may do a lot of work, walking, just going round and round, and um, get tired, especially if you're pregnant and you're going to buy the baby's clothes or something like that so it's good to have an idea of where you're going some malls are expensive and some are cheap so for me i had already done my research i already knew the mall that i was going to and uh, where i was going to buy the clothes i actually bought everything from one shop i'll be giving you the name of the mall at the end of this video so watch out and the contacts uh for the exact shop where i bought the items so stay tuned and I will give you that information so before we continue if you have not liked this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not subscribed so I have my, my big bag right here <laughs> it's a really huge Nigerian bag and I have my list of everything that I bought at Isley I will be giving you the prices too so that maybe you can budget and then at least have an idea of what you want to buy right there without without you know guys when you go to a baby's shop you can buy anything anything that you are seeing so you at least you need to have an idea of what you want and the price is right here so what do i start with 
Oh my god, there's so many things right here. So I bought this dozen of babies vests. This is how they look like and the cotton is very heavy so the vest will be warm to the baby it is like a really nice vest very heavy the cotton is really nice and uh, I bought them in one dozen that means that they are 12 pieces I think this they will be enough even when uh, we are in the season of cold you know it's raining the baby will have enough vests Plus, I have also added some others, the thrifted ones. So then, adding this on top, they will be enough for the baby. So I added 12 and I bought these for one dozen of the vests at 1500. Yeah, I bought them at 1500. Yes, at 1500 and they are 12 pieces. I also bought these beads. Uh, they are really nice, guys. They are how many in pieces? I think they are 12, not 10, not 12, 10. This is how they look like. This is how they look like. Um, the, the inner line, lining is more of a uh, nylonish in such a way that if the top part is wet the the fluid or anything cannot like penetrate and make the baby to be wet so i was excited because i got 10 of them in different colors and uh, it was going for 600 so 10 pieces for 600 the next thing that i bought is this shawl it is big in size let me show you so it is two-sided cream white not cream white cream yellow or cream white on one side and white in color on the other side so this is the white the white side and the cream side I don't know whether you guys can be able to see closely. Let me show you. Yeah, that's the color. That's the color. And it is really warm. If you can see the the fur. And the fur is really nice. It's not coming out in a way that it can affect the baby. I bought two of these shawls. And what I had in mind. I just, I wanted the white pipe and different colors so this was cream yellow i don't know if it's cream yellow or cream white and uh, there is this green one a very light shade of green the light shade of green so we have the white side and the light shade of green. Let me show you closely. Yeah, this is it, guys. So I bought two because I don't think that I actually need a lot of them because these are not the shows that you use a lot, a lot, a lot in the house, a lot of time in the house. Maybe when it is extremely cold, you know, or maybe when you're traveling or something like that. So for me, two white now. Um, I bought them at 900 each. So I bought this at 900 and this other one at 900. And something else that I bought are these hats. They're too small. Um, Hats. they are so cute let me show you I got this color 
I got the white one. I got the peach one. I got the green one. And I got the pink one. So I bought the hats at 300. So six of them at 300. And uh, I also bought the hand gloves. The hand gloves were going for 450. For how many pieces? I think they are six too. Yeah, six. So if you can see closely, um, the hand gloves are matching with the hats. So I have the green one. I have the peach one. Peach one. I have the white one right here you can be able to see and uh, I have the blue one the pink one yeah so for the hand gloves I bought them at 450 this pack of six and for the hats I bought them at um, 300 six of them six of them are enough because I actually don't think that kids really like to wear hats so they will be enough as a first time mom and there's this yellow one guys looks so cute um what else did I buy I also bought this receiving set wow guys which has eight pieces this receiving set was going for 1500 pop and I really love it. Let me show you. I bought white, white in color, the color white. And this is the, I think this is the outfit that I will uh, dress my baby after delivery. It will, it is the one that will receive the baby. And I'm excited. Oh my God, they're so tiny. So there is this uh, white sweater that has the hood, it's hood-like. So this is how it's looking like. Uh, there is the round neck sweater too. And they have this cartoon right here. So this is how this one looks like. Let me show you how this other one looks like. This is how it looks like. And it has the wood uh, there is this other I think they are there is this other romper which is long this is how it looks like the receiving set is is actually well detailed there is this trouser right here that has the socks part and uh, we have another trouser that is open down here um, we have a t-shirt a white one in color and uh, we have this shawl the receiving the receiving it's, it's like a shawl or something like mm, how do I call it <laughs> it is very light guys like a receiving shawl but it is so light I don't know how I can call it. I don't know those names, guys. <laughs> I'm a first time mom. And we have now the heavy one. The shawl that is now heavy, heavy, heavy. I don't know whether you guys can be able to see the difference. This is how this one looks like. And this is how. This one has like a t-shirt. A t-shirt vibe. And this one is heavy. So for all those pieces, I bought it at 1500 and I was excited to get it. So that is the receiving set for the baby. Immediately the baby will be born. That's the set that will receive the baby. It has everything that I will need, but I will have to add a vest and maybe socks, diaper definitely, and all those things, guys. I will organize them later. They will actually have to be washed <laughs> and i will do that together with my husband we are really enjoying doing that 
So the receiving set we bought at 1500. I will give you the contacts and the name of them all at the end of this video. Something else that we bought is this baby care kit. Oh my god, it's so cute. Let me show you. It's really nice. We have the brush. We have the comb. We have the thermometer for temperature. I hope it works. We have the nail cutter down here. We have something to remove uh, the makamasi and all. We have makasi, the scissors. We have so many things. We have the nail file and everything. So if you observe my haul, it is so unisex, guys. Right now, I don't mind buying any color, whether it's pink, whether it's blue any unisex color because i'm not planning to have a huge gap between my first one and second one so most of the items that i will buy for my first one will also be used by the second one some of them but for something like baby care kits no they can't share i will have to buy another one another different one yeah so right now when buying things i'm not more of buying things according to sex or the gender of the baby I also have the baby blankets. They are light. Six pack baby washcloth blanket. It's so light. You see now when you're at home and you're holding your baby and you it's it's you don't want to use the heavy shoes. We have this pack of light shoes. They are six pieces. And they were going for how much? One thousand. I bought them at one thousand. Let me show you closely. This is how they look like. There are six pieces. One, two, three, four, five, six. Here they are. Let me show you the size. This is the size. They are big. Yeah, they are big. They are big. And I really like that, guys. So, it's a pack of six at 1200 And something else that I bought from uh, Isli is this marking torch. This marking torch is cream white, cream yellow in color. what you use for example when you want to change your baby yeah this is how it looks like so when I want to change the baby for example so you have the changing station you just place this on top and uh, if you check at the inner material guys it cannot leak something like urine or anything like water or something so it's really nice it's really nice so i bought these at what was it at 500 no at 400 i bought it at 400 cream yellow in color because the theme for the nursery for the baby nursery is uh it has white color white paint uh cream white paint the wardrobe has this cream yellow color and it has some orange some gray i will show you guys i'll show you the colors i'll show you when we get there so that's why i had this color in me Something else that I got is this nursing pillow. The nursing pillow I bought at 1000 pop. This is how it looks like. Let me show you. The one that you use when you're feeding the baby to prevent back pains and all. And guys, I don't know 
I will be able to return it in here after removing it. Yeah, it's not a big job. So this is how you use it. For example, if you are breastfeeding the baby, you just wear it around your waist. Yeah, and just hold your baby and breastfeed the baby like this. That's the use. That's the essence of it. I really like it. Um, this is a cover that you can remove and wash. We have the zip here. You can always remove this. Um, it's big. Only that I'm pregnant. You can always remove this cover and wash. So I bought the nursing pillow at uh, 1000 bob. This is for the purpose of breastfeeding the baby. I will return them also after I have done the whole the whole haul. <laughs> I also bought the towel, two of them at 500 bob each. So I bought the yellow one. It's big too. This is yellow in color. And I bought the white one. It's the same size. So these are the baby towels. So this is yellow. Yes, this yellow. The yellow color. I hope you can be able to see because of lighting. And then I have this white one. In color. I was excited to do to get them. So for now, two are enough. Two are enough. Um, I also bought the baby liners. The purpose, the reason as to why I bought these liners is because I might need them to to maybe wipe the baby. You can use these liners in so many ways. Maybe wipe the baby. Do something I don't know so many things guys that you can use them for you know so many purposes so the need for these light liners they are um, white in color I bought the liner the liners they are cotton 12 of 12 of them at 500 bob yes I was excited to get these liners at that price um, I also bought this pack of the washing clothes. Here they are. They are six in pieces. The washing clothes. I can't wait to wash these things and pack them in the baby's wardrobe. This is how they look like. The material, the, 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 the pieces that you use to wash the baby. So I bought six of them at 250. They were going for 250. Uh -huh. And the last thing that I bought at Isley, and uh, this the breastfeeding. They're called breastfeeding what? Disposable. No, these ones are washable. Washable breast pads. So these are the pads that you use to on your bra when you're breastfeeding the baby. Yeah, so that you don't mess up and all. I'm also planning to get the electric pump so that I can always collect milk on one side as the baby is breastfeeding on the other side. I'm yet to get the electric um, pump, the electric pump, but I will get one. I don't want money because it's a lot of work. So this is how the the pads are looking like the breastfeeding pads yeah that's how they look like they are really nice yeah and that's it for is haul guys tell me was it worth it or not for me it was worth it because i think for one towel buying one towel from a retail shop it would go for 1500 or a thousand getting uh, this nursing pillow, a color that I would have wanted. It's really nice. The shoes, everything, and the varieties that I got from there, guys. 
there were so many so i was i was excited for all this and i'm happy i thank god for this opportunity for giving me this opportunity to experience motherhood for me i don't take it on a light note or for granted because i know that there are so many people who would want to be moms out there but they're not in that capacity to be moms so for me i don't take it for granted and you guys if you're looking for a baby just know that i'm always praying for you that god will bless your womb yeah it's a beautiful experience when you are ready for it so that's my sleigh haul and uh, i'm happy and excited for it yeah guys so make sure that you give this video a like subscribe turn on the notification bell so that next time when i upload a new video you guys will be able to to get the notification and be among the first people to watch this video yeah so the next video that i'm shooting after this is the kamukonji shopping haul so after this video guys subscribe and make sure that you watch the next video that i will be uploading a few days later i don't know the time that you're watching this video if it is way way later just check for the next video that i uploaded after this the kamukonji shopping haul for the baby and you will love it guys it is massive what let me do the haul so thank you guys subscribe i love you all and until next time bye bye I love you.